Hello every pony, Corpulent Brony here. Today I'm going to show all you socially inept brony losers, I mean all you beautiful, wonderful people, how to professionally wrap a gift. In order to wrap a present, first you must acquire one. Some of the elite 1% like to buy their gifts. Hi, Mr. Moneybags. Others, with more talent, make gifts. Why isn't this working? What is going on here? What is it? We're making Santa hats. Like, why do you have the purple yarn out anyway? I prefer giving things I own away. It's super classy and is a great way to recycle those items that you no longer really want. Where's that at? I, I know she'll love it. Bitches love pieces of shit. When selecting a gift, don't worry about whether or not you'll be able to wrap it. I've wrapped all sorts of gifts. Long ones, abnormally shaped ones, even wriggling ones. Once you know what gift you're gonna wrap, the next step is to choose your wrapping paper. Make sure it's adequate to the reason for wrapping, whether holiday, birthday, or some other occasion. And always ensure it's covered in ponies. Now, you're also gonna need some tape. Them rich folks like to use scotch tape. But you can also use duct tape or electrical tape or really anything else you may have lying around. Oops, how'd that get in here? The secret to wrapping a gift and making it look amazing is to not be afraid to use too much tape. Really, there's no such thing. The final step is upon us, intrepid adventurer. Now you must find the perfect recipient for your professionally wrapped gift. Hey, Filiance, I got you something special for Hearth's Warming Eve this year. Thank you. Masquerade? This ah, is my G1. Yeah, aren't you happy? This is my G1 pony that my parents got me when we were in Hong Kong when I was 10. Why did you take her? What are you doing with her? Ah! And that's how you wrap a present. Join me next time as we explore cures for a black eye. See you later, every pony. Thank <laughs> you.